Hello, everybody. This is the uh, Pixel Gamer here. Reporting for duty. As you can probably guess. Playing Borderlands One. Perhaps I am a fool, but do not be fooled by what Pandora appears to be. There was a legend. Many people tell it. The legend of the Vault. Yep. My father would always go on about the Vault, even with his dying breath. Advanced alien technology. I might as well start from the uh, beginning of the game. Fame. So of skipping into it like I did the uh, Nine Toes tutorial. So you can understand why some little. Kiddos who hear the stories grow up to become vault hunters. Well, I have a story you may not believe, but I tell you it is true. The legend of the vault is real, and it is here on Pandora. And, uh, yeah, let's call her a guardian angel, appear to guide the vault hunters to their prize. The tale begins right here on Pandora with the brave vault hunters, the guardian angel. Most importantly, me. I love Marcus. I love Marcus. He's awesome. Alright. I'm just going to skip through this because we can actually skip through that. Alright. Uh, I might turn the volume down a bit. If I'm, uh, for a later episode, I don't know. Alright, well, I thought, might as well, we were the soul, we were uh, rolling in the uh, intro thing, might as well be rolling again. Don't be alarmed. Why not? I need you to stay calm and don't let on that anyone is talking to you. Start making your way off the bus. I just find her eyes a little creepy, because I find her eyes to be a little creepy. I can't even feel the whites. It looks almost like she has black eyes with a blue iris, which is just... I mean, it's cool, but it's like Uncanny Valley type deal. Also, if you notice the... Quick question. Someone else noticed the weird thing with Marx's head? See that, like, afterglow? You can see when he's turning his head around. Or, or moving his head, for that matter. I'm, I think that's a graphical issue. Personally. Alright. But anyways, like I said, we're playing as Roland again because why not? He's he's a good starting character. He's fun to play it with and that Scorpio turret, oh my god, that Scorpio turret comes in handy. It really does. Anyways, like I said before, um this is gonna be the first probably the first let's play I'm gonna be doing on this channel. Uh, Borderlands. Probably, quite possibly, one of, my, one of my favorite games of all time. Holy crap, do I love this game. It is, uh... It, I just, I love it. It's, I love everything about it. The humor, the action, the gameplay, the characters, even Claptrap. I, I love Claptrap, even though I hate him. It's, uh... It's a love-hate relationship with when it comes down to Claptrap. Yeah. Gotta sit through all this crap now. No? Who knows? We might get some better guns in this playthrough. I'm hoping it's some very guns in this playthrough. Great! I detected your echo device is fully. Can we start moving? Oh, we can start moving. Way, Sweet. Please. Okay. So we're back in the back in the uh, saddle once again, boys and girls. Starting up with another Oh well, not, not another, starting up with the first let's play. Uh, Borderlands one. Hopefully. You guys will enjoy, you guys and girls, guys and gals, everyone, will enjoy this as much as I will. And, uh, yeah, we'll see what kind of mischief we can get into. 
on this adventure on this uh, not so very pretty planet that we're on. Hey, curiosity, is this a uh, gun better than the last, than the uh, other version did? Nope, so crap. Oh well. It's pretty good, all the same. Uh, if the volume is too loud, I will actually not, I don't, well, I won't actually know if the volume is too loud. Louder than me talking. Um, if it is, well, when I'm editing this, I'll certainly uh, edit or turn the sound down so that you guys can hear my lovely, lovely voice, which isn't, well, my microphone isn't doing me any favors either. It's a very old microphone. I think we got it like back in like the 2000s or something. Anyways, I gotta get a. Uh, I would be using the microphone that's built into my laptop. I'm, I'm running on an Asus laptop. Uh, it's nothing special. Probably one of its lower end models. I don't know. Anyways. Uh, oh, finally a sniper rifle. And it's a Jacobs. You know you're going to have a good time when you open up the chest and you get a Jacobs sniper rifle. Holy crap. Uh, fortunately, I cannot equip it because it's level 4. Oh, jeez. Level 4 shit out the box. Jesus. So, well, it's a lot better than that scatter gun we got. First time around. Uh, sniper rifle ammo. Anyways, about the microphone. Yeah, I'm using a really old microphone. It's not that super. But, uh, yeah. Hopefully everyone can hear me. I hope. Yeah. Don't exactly know if I want to cut any of this out or anything. I don't know. Alright, yes, we're going over to see the funny talking idiot robot. Slap trap, how you doing, buddy? I love you. Not really. Kind of. It depends on my mood and how I feel that day. Step right up. This is the new U station. Probably gonna cut here. At least cut to where I, you know, I'll, I'll cut to where I'm done customizing what I'm going to look like in this playthrough. Alright, so the pi um, pixeled, pixeled gamer colors are going to be our home colors. Uh, let me see here. Green armor. That's a little sash you rather than me. Uh, that and uh, black thing. Yeah, alright. Okay. Alright, this work. Alright. Grab some more repeater pistol slugs because we're going to need it. Sorry about that sudden jerk. That was me adjusting my arm. Yeah. Alright. There's an occasional cut. Again, that's because... Oh, gee, contract, I'm right here. I opened the damn gate. There's an occasional cut. That's because I'm using the unregistered version of Bandicam. So, I only have 10 minutes of recording time. I mean, 10 minutes is almost up by looks of things. So there's gonna be a slight cut here. Okay. Right, so that was the. All right, now into the combat. Nailed it. Not the barrel, not the dude. Should probably reload. I mean, that'd be a good idea. Let me, let me do that real quickly. Uh, I'm gonna try and keep this, these videos, uh, 20 minutes at the most. So I hope, so hopefully we'll get done with this tutorial part. And, uh, we can move on to the, to the more fun parts of the game where we'll start. Oh, I 
forgot about this toilet here. It's random toilets out in the middle of nowhere with uh, ammunition and supplies in them. That's a claptrap over there, and there's a dude right there. Got a... And he's dead. Might as well as hold the trigger down because. Alright. That just about covers it. Just, uh. Yes, I know about the box clap trap. Shut up. All right, we got guns over here. Better guns than the one we currently got. Wow. All right, let's see if I can uh, equip one of these. Which one am I going to equip? Uh, well, personally, let's go with the RF repeater. Why not? Why not? Okay. The things, if uh, eh, depends. Mm. Crap. Sorry, I was gonna need some drink of water. Okay, come on. Yep. Can you guys tell I've already done this a lot? Uh, yeah, I uh, tend to get bored. Easily, and I start a lot of playthroughs. I, play, I, I played through this game. Well, I played through it once as Roland and beat it completely. I don't have any of the DLCs packs, by the way. Uh, I have a few for the second game, but I don't have any for this one. This gun is terrible. Like, actually, that gun is really terrible. I'm gonna switch to this one with the actual scope. Oh, you know that hurt. All right, what we got? We got some more rifle and some more money. Money, money, y'all. Dollar bills. Gotta get them dollar bills. Snap rifle cartridges, awesome. Can't use snap rifle yet, but uh, oh well. Use and oh barrel. Oh. Yeah. Kill the bandit by the barrel. Well, so he'll hit the barrel. He'll probably die. I'll probably die. Oh Jesus. I actually hit this guy. No. What a shame. I'm just off to do it the old-fashioned way then. All right. So, so far so good. Nothing too challenging or too bad, to be honest with you. Oh, look, Errol. <coughs> I love doing that. I, I, I do it, I just do. Can I get their attention again? Oh, I actually hit him. That's impressive. Can I hit this guy? Nah, I didn't hit him. Oh, this is fine. Oh. I don't mean to reload when I'm picking my stuff up because uh, it makes it very, very, very. Uh... Oh, right gee. There's, wasn't there one other guy? I thought there was one other guy. Did I get the other guy? Oh. Must have gotten the other guy. Oh. Okay then. Well. Alright then. Uh. Yep. Leave us alone. Had to lock the place up tight. I'll let you in. Come on. Damn it. Blasted circuits are on the fritz again. Give it a go from the switch. Really, out really there, not on the fritz, Dad. Oh, really not on the fritz. Okay, yep. Yep, 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 yep. yep. I love this game. I, I, you're probably going to hear that a lot in this playthrough. Me just saying how much I love this game. 
even when I'm raging at the bosses, I'm gonna tell, I'm gonna just continue to praise this game because it is. Oh God, I love this game. You, you, you're gonna have a different experience every time you play this game. I know I have. I've had a different experience. Her up again. The yeah, we know. Don't, don't care. Yeah. Yay. Yep. Got it. Uh, please, uh, just keep flapping your please, keep flapping your, uh, uh, keep flapping your gums, uh, Zed while I, uh, rob you blind of all your loot. Oh, uh, yep, I love it up again. I forgot, I, I do that, I, yep. One of the things I think I liked about the second game that I like a little bit more than the first game is that the uh, badass tokens and badass ranks you can, or badass achievements you can get while playing through the second game carry over to any new profiles you create. So, basically, every time I start a new game on the second game, on the second Borderlands game, uh, whatever badass tokens I have from my first playthrough carries over to my second one, which means I'm full of ammo. Alright. Just uh, grab this. Take care of the bandits at the gate. Hopefully, no way to fix the trap up before uh, we have to end the episode. Yes, we know cloud trap. All right, so um, let's see if we can let's see if we can take these bandits out quickly. And I'll end the episode here. Not bad for the first episode. Maybe I'll maybe I'll well since that opening cutscene took so long, I'll uh, I might care, let it carry over a bit. She's the one guy right here. Kill him. And he's dead. Oh! Hell yeah, Roland. Critical biatch. Who says that anymore? Oh god. I'll, I'll try not to be cringy at all. No, seriously, I, I think he's fine. I think he's fine. He's good. Just, you know, you, you just, just walk it off, slugger. You got it. I'm oh, stopping such a drama queen. It's not that bad. No oh, shit. Isn't going to last very long without attention. Why don't you look around for something to fix? Really? Wait, he's not gonna last very long without attention? Hmm. You know, let's put that to let's put that to the test, shall we? Let's see how long it takes him. Let's see. Actually, I think we'll end the episode right here. So. I guess that's uh, what I'll do for now. Almost out of my. Uh, t Hopefully, I'll do for now. I uh, guess I'll end the episode here at the sound of Clap Trap moaning in pain. Even though he's a robot, technically shouldn't, he couldn't, shouldn't feel pain, technically. Oh, dear God, he's such a drama queen. Anyways, guys, that was the first episode of hopefully my new Borderlands 1 series. I hope you guys had a lovely time, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. This has been the Pixeled Gamer, signing out.